Knights, ladies, generals, I bid you welcome for centuries. Knights has been established as a mean of honour of men of chivalry. Both on and off the battlefield, knights are men of honour, defenders of the realm and warriors of virtue. The honour of the knighthood should be seen as a destination rather than a step along the life of a long journey. Bestowing the accolade is an acknowledgement of one who is ready, already walking the path, but also a challenge for them to stay upon this path always. It is a difficult path, one fraught with obstacles and challenges. It is not to be entered lightly. Today we are gathered to honour those who walk the path with dignity and humanity and bestow the accolade of knighthood. This is a time of celebration and we welcome you to behold and celebrate with us. There is one amongst us who is to be brought forward to receive this accolade of knighthood. Craig, please step forward. Are you ready to begin? I am ready. Do the lords and ladies here present assist to the powers of dominance, courtesy, loyalty, service, honour and fidelity of this candidate. We do. As a knight of the order of the marshal, you will be expected to uphold chivalry at all times. Always and everywhere must you be the champion to the right and the good. Repeat after me. A knight must show valour in the face of fear. A knight must show valour in the face of fear. He must forever defend the weak. He must forever defend the weak. His sword may only fight for justice. His sword may only fight for justice. His word must be true. His word must be true. And honour will be his shield. And honour shall be his shield. Do you swear to maintain his virtues from this day forward? I do so swear. Then kneel and receive the accolade of honour. As the knight's spurs goad the war horse, so should they goad the knight to valour, service, diligence and swiftness. Let the spurs hasten the knight to his duty that he must maintain his order in the height, in the height of honour and become to it. By placing these precious spurs near to his feet, a knight displays the stamp and worldly things. They should be worn with honour and discretion, lest they be hacked off from his heels in shame and disgrace. Receive these spurs and wear them as a symbol of virtue, power and knighthood.
Arise, I pray, and I will be on the master.